Chicago PD searching for a group of young males they say are behind a violent armed robbery in the French Quarter Wednesday night. It happened around 10 o'clock in the 1000 block of Governor Nichols. Police say the suspects stabbed one of the victims multiple times and robbed another at gunpoint. WDSU reporter Andy Cunningham live in the French Quarter with what investigators are doing right now to identify the attackers. Camille, detectives are scanning through multiple surveillance systems from up and down this portion of Governor Nichols. And we received just a small portion of that video earlier today, but we must warn you, some of the video may be considered graphic. The video is disturbing. A 43-year-old man stabbed multiple times in the middle of the street. Not heard here, but residents say his screams were horrifying. I hear this guy scream, you know, I'm bleeding, I'm bleeding. Jim Harper, one of several residents in the 1000 block of Governor Nichols, home at the time of the attack. I dialed 911 right quick, uh, but by the time I got back out here, they had all scattered. Police say moments earlier, the same group of up to eight males robbed a 21-year-old male at gunpoint, stealing his wallet and cell phone. For the moment, it seems to be very violent robberies, crimes against people. Longtime French Quarter resident Bob Sims described the recent wave of violent crime in the city's most famous neighborhood like the wild, wild west. We've seen a significant uptick check in the last, uh, well, actually since the state troopers left. On Wednesday, police released this video of another armed robbery. Three males seen knocking the male victim unconscious on Dauphine, stealing his belongings. <laughs> This brawl on Bourbon Street over the weekend has been seen by almost 100,000 people online. It's the latest to break out on the popular strip. You know, what looked like was going to be a one on one fight, uh, you know, what looked like a vicious gang attack just within a matter of seconds. The departure of state police, combined with the shortage of street cops, has residents and business owners pleading for more. I don't know what we're going to do about it, but we need to do something because it's really getting critical. Really bad. Now, earlier this week, the NOPD chief Michael Harrison reassigned 22 officers that were working administra administrative, excuse me, positions to the streets. Three of those officers, combined with four of the department's newest graduating class of recruits, have been assigned here to the Eighth District, which includes the French Quarter. Reporting live on your side from the French Quarter, I'm Andy Cunningham, WDSU News. The victim in the Governor Nichols armed robbery has a punctured lung, but we're told his injuries are not life threatening. In this case, French Quarter Realty is offering an additional $1,000 reward on top of the Crime Stoppers reward for any information leading to an arrest and indictment in this case.